thing here as a basketball player, dealing with adversity with the Achilles injury, and is he too old, and can he come back and play? You know, those are all pressures uh, that we as athletes deal with. Those are challenges that we deal with. And when you look at those challenges in a vacuum, they feel like they're the most important, the most significant things in the world that are going on when you look at them in isolation. However, when you step outside of that, you look at Sabrina, Tracy, what they had to go through as a family, and what they've come out of, that's true adversity, and that's responding to true conflict and being true inspirations. And um, what they're doing now, telling that story, I believe is absolutely phenomenal because those are stories that need to be told. And players such as myself and others who have kind of the platform, um, our responsibility is more than putting the ball in the basket, but it's helping them have the platform to be able to get to this point. Um, for the, I think, for the, for the, for the kids that are, that are here, um, the, the one thing that I, that I will say is find your passion. Find what you are absolutely passionate about. And it, it takes some searching, it takes some you know, experimenting, whether it's writing or photography or whatever the case may be. Find what you're passionate about. And the reason why that is so important is because once you find what you're passionate about, everything else in your life lines up. Everything makes sense. You wake up in the morning and you have an absolute purpose of what you're here to do and what you're here to accomplish. So I challenge that all the young people here and the adults here to help the next generation find what they're passionate about. And uh, then it becomes our responsibility to guide them and mentor them along the way so they can accomplish great things and wind up changing the world. And it starts with us. So uh, I'm not going to keep you guys any longer. Thank you so much for having me here. And, uh, and uh, have a blessed, blessed day. Thank you.